everyone thank you for joining in we're talking about the claims of jesus the i am claims and today we will look at his claim to be the resurrection and the life in john 11 verse 25 and 26 jesus said to her i am the resurrection and the life he who believes in me though he may die he shall live and whoever lives and believes in me shall never die do you believe this so this um uh, is is an incident uh, uh, you would recall from john chapter 11 where jesus is good friends are going through a distressing time Th- these are um martha mary and lazarus so lazarus um uh, was ailing and he has now died uh, and jesus comes after lazarus's death and he's speaking to mary and martha and he is trying to elicit faith from their hearts and he's telling them look lazarus is dead but he's pointing to himself and making a claim and he's saying i am the resurrection and the life it's a very strong claim um for a human being to to make and he's saying i am the resurrection and the life he who believes in me though he may die he shall live so what he was saying is that he is going to give them a foretaste of what he would later do on the cross once he dies on the cross and pays for the sins of mankind um all who believe in him they they will have eternal life though they die in in this life we have physical death but that is not the end of life life will continue in eternity but uh though jesus was going to do all of that what he was telling mary and martha is also this that you are going to see the resurrection of your brother and it was probably very hard for them to believe because they hadn't seen anything like that during their times but we know what happened later jesus goes up to the tomb of lazarus and says lazarus come forth uh and you know lazarus comes out alive and um people are amazed and in fact from this um time on a lot of a lot of people are also against him because they have seen the demonstration of a supernatural act and a great one at that so jesus is strongly confidently and directly claiming that he is the author of life in such a way that even death cannot take away that power from him he is the resurrection even if the those who believe in him experience physical death we know that there is a time when christ will return and those who are dead in christ will rise and the bible calls uh, the death of believers as falling asleep so anyone who believes in the lord jesus has this confidence that we have not perished forever but we will rise again because jesus has become our resurrection and the life and during his ministry as a foretaste there were three uh, at least three resurrect recorded resurrections now we don't know the bible does say that he did so many miracles and you know many other things which are not recorded but uh, among what is recorded he raised lazarus uh, jairus's daughter the son of nine and he gave a foretaste of what he would do through his work on the cross jesus is the resurrection and we have confidence in this life and even in the life to come let's pray together heavenly father we thank you for jesus who has become the resurrection for us lord father we thank you for such a great hope lord the hope that carries on into eternity and uh, thank you lord thank you for the hope of resurrection from the dead as well we give you praise in jesus name we pray amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.